Okay, and this is um, cal hypo or calcium hypochlorite. It's a very uh, powerful form of chlorine in a powdered form that you'll find in your pool store. Uh, this super shock wave is actually the highest level that I can find. It's got 73% active cal hypo in it, which is really good. Okay, you have to also know that the cal hypo is a highly flammable material. So you want to be careful not to store it anywhere near any flammable things. And if you have a colored plaster pool or fiberglass pool, um, I would recommend not broadcasting it in there because it will um, not dissolve right away and it may stain the plaster in some cases. And since it has a high pH, actually of almost 11.0, it will not damage the equipment uh, at all. So you can actually pour it in to your skimmer like this and that is an effective way to broadcast it in your pool as it will return. Make sure your system is running of course for at least three or four hours after you add it that way it broadcasts completely. And when I got to this particular pool and tested the water the chlorine level was lower than 1.0 and two bags of cal hypo will definitely raise it up to 5.0. And remember also that cal hypo uh, does not have any conditioner in it like the trichlor tablets and like liquid chlorine the sun will eat it right away and after shocking the pool or using any chemical in the pool you want to wait at least three hours as it circulates through and filters through your system and if you have a salt water pool you probably don't want to use cal hypo because that really causes a lot of calcium buildup inside the salt cell itself i would stick with liquid chlorine 